Welcome to our Excel tutorial. In this video, we'll guide you through four effective methods to hide zero values in Excel. Whether you prefer using format settings, conditional formatting, the if function, or adjusting Excel options, we've got you covered. Let's dive in and make your data analysis clearer and more efficient. In data analysis, zeros can sometimes be misleading or irrelevant. We'll show you how to make them disappear so your data presentation is cleaner and more insightful. Let's consider a weekly consumption report. It's filled with numbers, including some zeros that don't contribute to our analysis. We'll begin with the first method, using Excel's format settings to visually hide zeros. This is a straightforward approach that anyone can apply. Start by selecting the range of cells in your table that contains the zeros you want to hide. It's the first step towards a cleaner table. Right-click on the selected cells and choose Format Cells from the context menu. Alternatively, press Ctrl plus 1 for a quick shortcut to the Format Cells dialog. In the Format Cells dialog, switch to the Custom category. This is where you can define how numbers, dates, and text appear in your cells. In the Type field, enter this format string. This custom format string tells Excel to display zeros as blank, while keeping other numbers and text intact. Click OK to apply the custom format. Watch as the zeros in your selected range vanish, instantly improving the readability of your data. Now, let's move on to the second method, using Excel's conditional formatting feature to selectively hide zeros. With your table still selected, navigate to the Home tab and click the arrow next to Conditional Formatting to reveal a list of formatting rules. Choose Highlight Cells Rules and then Equal To to create a new rule that targets cells with specific values. In the New Formatting Rule dialog, Enter 0 in the left text box to specify that we want to apply formatting to cells with a value of 0. To make these zeros invisible, set the font color to white. This will blend the zeros into the background, effectively hiding them from view. Complete the formatting by setting the border and fill colors to automatic, then click OK to apply your new rule. For our third method, we'll use the powerful if function in Excel to dynamically hide zeros as you enter data. In an adjacent cell to your data, type the formula equals if a2 equals 0, a2. This formula checks if the value in cell a2 is 0. If it is, the cell will remain blank. Drag the fill handle down to apply the formula to the rest of the cells in the column. This will automatically hide any zeros as you populate your table. Let's delve into our final method for hiding zeros in Excel, adjusting the application's global settings. This approach is particularly useful if you want a consistent appearance across multiple worksheets or an entire workbook. Start by going to File in the top left corner of the Excel window. From the drop-down menu, select Options to open the Excel Options dialog box. This is where you can customize a wide range of settings that affect how Excel behaves. In the Excel Options dialog, you'll see a panel on the left with various categories. Click on Advanced to access more specialized settings. Scroll down the list of advanced options until you find the section titled Display Options for this worksheet. Here, you'll see a checkbox labeled Show a zero in cells that have zero value. By default, this checkbox is ticked, which means Excel displays zeros as they are in every cell. However, if you uncheck this box, Excel will automatically hide any zeros in cells, displaying them as blank instead. The advantage of this method is its simplicity and universality. Once you uncheck this option, the change applies to all worksheets in the current workbook, instantly transforming how zeros are displayed across the board. If you ever need to revert this change, simply return to the Advanced Settings and recheck the Show a zero in cells that have zero value box. This will restore the display of zeros to their original visibility. Click OK to save your changes and close the Excel Options dialog. Now, as you navigate through your workbook, you'll notice that all zeros are no longer visible, streamlining your data presentation. This method is a great choice for users who want a quick and easy way to manage the appearance of zeros without having to apply formatting to individual cells or ranges. With these four methods, you're now equipped to manage how zeros appear in your Excel spreadsheets, making your data presentation more polished and your analysis more precise. 
That concludes our tutorial on hiding zero values in Excel. If you found this helpful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more Excel tips and tricks.